not gonna work. Should we try I this now? I think I'll get lost in it. Hi, I'm Jenna Torrey, assistant editor at Shape Magazine. I'm here at Flying Tells in Manhattan. I'm getting married in February, and I brought our executive style director, Jackie Stafford, with me to find my dream dress. We are going to get her the perfect dress. Hello. Hi. Hi. Jenna, how are you? Good. My name is Debbie, and I'll be your bridal consultant today. I'm here to help you select your perfect wedding dress. Come on, come follow me. A great tip for any bride to be is always bring pictures. Well, pictures definitely give us a better idea as to what you're looking for. And I think now after seeing these, I actually do have a better idea of what you're looking for. Good. So let's go try some dresses on. Debbie, I know that we'd, we'd, we were talking about why this doesn't work for her. The fabric itself is very unforgiving. It's a silk charmeuse, which has got a sheen to it, and anything with a sheen is going to make something look larger. So just remember that. If you're trying to emphasize a part of your body, that's where you'd want to put some sheen, because that gives everything a bit more volume. I think we both agree that it's too low cut here. If you do have a fuller bust, you will want to avoid things that are very low cut. You don't want to be all about the boobs. So just all the embellishment here would be great on someone that had less of a bust to give the illusion of a fuller bust. Anything with a sheen is going to amplify, it's going to add volume. So you would only want to put sheen where you want something to look bigger. This is a little clingy for her. It separates her body into three halves. Now if you're tall, you would want that. But if you're on the shorter side like Jenna, you want to longer, make her look longer and leaner. Well, I think the proportions are very good for you. Uh, yeah. I think the natural waist actually creates a longer leg. Great neckline, the ruching is very flattering. Um, you know, with this dress, I think we're having more back interest than we are front interest. Mm. And that's beautiful for ceremony, but after ceremony right. and your photographs, everything will be from here on. Right. I love the uh, scalloping on the Alain Saint Lace neckline. I think it's very beautiful on you, and that will be in all of your photos. Um, I love accentuating the natural waistline. And you can certainly do this in any color sash. You can match your bridesmaids if you like. And also, this dress has a little bit of interest at the bottom with the pickups. It's very soft, it's feminine, it's flowy. Yes. Debbie picked out the perfect neckline for her, which is not straight across. Anything straight across would give her more of a flatter looking bust. And with a slight dip, it, gives, it shows off her beautiful bust line Much here. Much more flattering with the dip in the neckline, absolutely. Much more flattering. I know you love the ruching here. I love the ruching in this area because I think also this is very, very flattering. 